Overnight, two people killed on the streets of Portland, and police tell us the two-year rise in violence we're seeing is not slowing down. Yeah, here we go again. Well, Jenny Young live with the latest details from police. And Jenny, there is a suspect in custody for one of these killings. There is. We just got that update within the hour, Jeff. 38-year-old Christopher Groves accused of shooting and killing a man in the Montevilla neighborhood. And I want you to hear these numbers, Jeff Liz. So in the last 20 days, we're only 20 days into the new year, police say there have been 57 reported shootings in Portland, 19 people injured in those shootings. Three uh, killed, including the uh, two most recent here in the Coley neighborhood and over in Montevilla. Portland police called to a deadly shooting just before midnight in the Cully neighborhood. Officers arriving at an apartment on Northeast 42nd in Prescott found a man shot to death. They did look for suspect or suspects, uh, but none were located immediately and no arrests were made in that case. Two hours later, homicide detectives called to another shooting, this time in the Montevilla neighborhood at Southeast 85th and Taylor. When they arrived, they located an adult male uh, who was deceased of an apparent gunshot wound. Um, in this one, the person involved in the shooting, uh, a man remained at the scene uh, and was speaking with officers. Allen says for now, detectives aren't releasing any more details. Coin Six reported last year when the police bureau moved detectives from a different division to help the overloaded homicide division. Allen says even with the additional help, the team is still struggling to keep up. I asked if there's been any talk within the bureau to transfer more detectives to homicide. I have not heard about any plans to add any further resources to the homicide unit, at least in the near term. Um, it's no secret that we have a bit of a staffing crisis uh, on our hands. Uh, we're working our way through it and we are hiring more people than uh, we're losing right now. And because of that case overload, he, uh, Sergeant Allen stressed the need for people uh, to report what they know about these shootings to Crime Stoppers or police. Again, within the hour, we are learning they did arrest a suspect in the Montevilla shooting, 38-year-old Christopher Gross. Reporting live in Northeast Portland, Jenny Young, Coin6 News. All right, now you just heard it in Jenny's report, Portland Police adding officers, but we found out there's a big delay when it comes to the training process. And he brought...